Let's do it. It was an idea started between three friends back in 1993, and now 30, that's been 30 years, 30 1993. Years. 30 years. Oh, gosh, now I feel old. Years. Mad Max continues to bring the perfect mix of Mexican and Southern California flavors to the Pittsburgh area, and to help kick off the birthday bash, Bill Fuller is here from Big Burrito Restaurant Group. So glad you're here. I'm glad to be here. 30 be years? 30 years. 30 30 years. Reminder for all of us. But you were not getting served at Mad Max 30 years ago. I was not. It took you some years to get uh -huh. to that point. Absolutely. Like, like two years ago, you started getting served, right? That's right, yeah, yeah. exactly. Right. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for clarifying. Yeah. And we're going to make a little margarita here to celebrate. Well, yeah, so we're doing a bunch of things to celebrate the 30 year anniversary. Uh, we're going to have some rotating food special things. And we have the, the Trace Dakotas margarita, which Ooh. means three decades. Oh. Okay, yeah. that makes sense. And it, is there uh, something in it that is three decades old? Or? No, no, but okay. it, it's just a straight up margarita, tequila, um, an orange liqueur, uh, lemon lime juice, made real simply. I'm not shaking it because we've seen what happens when I shake. Sometimes it makes a mess. Sometimes I wear the margarita. <laughs> and this time I am not, I've actually spilled it up my arm already, <laughs> not even shaking it. And I it, don't know how that's possible, we, but you did it. We have these uh, Trace de Cotis glasses that when you get one of these Trace Dakotas margaritas until they run out. And this all starts a week from Monday, the 1st. The 1st, October 1st. But cheers. Cheers. Cheers, Mad Max. And so you're going to make some tacos for us today, too. I am going to make some tacos. So mm. we, we're, this is going to be our first special, and it's three different tacos on one plate. It is our um, beef birria, which when I, when I was working on the recipe, like in February, I brought it over here. And remember, it was too spicy. I like it, though. I know, but... Uh, you I, almost it down? I almost killed the other guy. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Pork carnitas, which we've uh, revamped and brought back, and chicken tinga, which is a roasted chicken thigh with like a, a mild chipotle sauce. So we're gonna put these together, and these are just a couple of the things that you'll run as specials right. during the month of October. Yeah, well, we're gonna have these. These are mostly on the menu, and all will be on the menu eventually. Uh, but we're gonna serve this trio plate for the first month of the celebration. I'm really enjoying this margarita. Well, I mean, isn't it kind of the end of your day? It is, and I really needed this. Yeah. Yeah, it's been a day. That's kind of, I mean, like you're ending your day with yoga, margarita, and tacos. I'm not like, going to lie to you. Like, I don't want my bosses to know, but it's not a bad gig, you know? I mean, it's not a bad, I've been kind of like keeping an eye on what you do here, and like. I know. There's a lot of this. Uh, there's a lot that, of this that happens, that's right. Does your husband know how much fun you have doing this? He does, yeah. yeah. That's why he says, you get paid to talk. That's what he tells me. Yeah. He then gets in trouble. Because, from you. Yeah. Because he says right. that. All right. That's, right. <laughs> that's <laughs> fair. <laughs> Tell me more about the, like, when you guys all met, how this all started so 30 years ago. It started before me. I didn't come along until 28 years ago. But so you were two years later. I was two years later. But there was a group of friends. You did that really fast. I used to do this for a living. <laughs> um, uh, uh, Tom Barron, who's the one founder, and. Um, his first partner, Juno Yoon, and their friend, Reva Sloan, who was an architect, who's since passed, and she was a lovely person, um, got this idea to start this funky Mexican restaurant in Oakland. And so, on no money, they put it together, did most of the work themselves, played loud music, made strong margaritas, made food that kind of approximated Mexican food, but, you know, we don't try to pretend we're Mexican. Yeah. Talk about it for you. There's like a lot of California flair in it, right? A lot of California flair in it. And mm -hmm. it's, you know, some of the flavors here are, are kind of traditional ethnic. The beef, beef birria is a very Mexican dish, which is the first one you're going to have. This is what I'm going to try first. It's the one you're going to try first. Good and tell me what wear. else is on, on this. Uh, a little bit of queso fresco and some cilantro and some pickled red onions. Just real simple. Mm. Uh, the second one will be a pork and pineapple queso. It's carnitas, pineapple, a little chipotle aioli. Wow. And then the third one is our chicken tinga. Again, that's a roasted chicken thigh meat, mild chipotle sauce. Um, and you got some rice and beans, some limes, and guacamole on the side if you want it. It is lovely, Bill. But this, this uh, like October 1st, we, we kick off this celebration. It's 30 years. I got, I got involved in the spring of 95. And then uh, uh, when we opened Kaya, and eventually I got involved with Mad Max 2. And it's just been a great ride. It's, it's it's been really wonderful to see how it's evolved, but stayed the same, too. And it's become a staple in Pittsburgh. It is. You know, it's like we were talking about it, and we feel like it's kind of Pittsburgh's kitchen table. Like, it's, you know, it's like everybody goes there. You go there to get because it's Tuesday, and you got soccer, and you get a, need something to eat. I love this. And what I really, you know I love, 
Mad Max now has the Gobblerito back on the menu. Oh, yeah. And you are coming on PTL next yeah. week. Next week. And we're rolling up some Gobbleritos. We're rolling some Gobbleritos. And even the name of it is still in question. Gobbler? Because it's, it's either Gobblerito or Gobblerito. And I prefer the Gobblerito because then it kind of sounds more like burrito. But some people like the Rito because it kind of sounds like a margarita. But I, you know. <laughs> It's gobble, gobble, you. either way. Linguist. Some linguist. Tell me what it should be. I, I got to tell you, these are all delicious. Stop in and try them. Help celebrate Mad Max's birthday bash. October 30th is the October big, 1st is the kickoff. Is the kickoff. Yeah. Is the big bash on the 30th? Yes. Big bash is the 30th. And Gobblerito's there now. 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 You can celebrate that now if you want. And there are nine locations, by the way, throughout the Pittsburgh area. And you have one in Erie and offer dine-in, take-out, and delivery as well. Thanks so much, Chef Bill, for coming in. Thanks for having us down here.